that's funny. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh. Okay, hold on. We'll get back up running. Okay. <laughs> okay, we back. <laughs> I've only hit the space bar and like one of the thing. Alright, how are we doing? Are we all are we all back? Are, can we all see everything again? I think we're good. <laughs> oh yeah, so there's there's a grace period for that. I'll just have to edit those two together. It's fine. That's my own damn fault. So this, that's what happens when I get too excited making fun of Fokker. I end up destroying my own stream. I, I need to find... I need to find a helicopter. <laughs> uh, what's crazy, I didn't even hit, like, I was like, okay, did I hit Alt F4 or something? Oh no, would would I would I would just I would just like control R. Just hit control R. It's one of ours. Alright, I need to find a Hella Chapter ASAP. ASAP! -P. I thought there was one not too far from here. <laughs> I feel bad now. Little did I know that I would provoke that kind of action in a fit of rage and anger. I slammed my keyboard into my face. <laughs> I could have sworn there's a helicopter around here somewhere, especially like the American one that I could use. <laughs> he did it to himself. That's that's the story of my life. Wood, just restart the stream. Just control R. Oh, there it is. There's my helicopter. Oh, I feel bad for Wood now. Just refresh the page, Wood. It's my fault. I'm sorry. I should have I should have known better. I got too excited making fun of him. I need something moved. Uh let's see. Sure, let's do that. Oh, this thing is just absolutely atrocious to fly though. This thing is this thing like this thing flies like a giant metal box. Whoa, that can't be good. Oh, uh, I'm going down. I'm going. Uh, I'm getting shot. 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 Holy. Oh, oh, time to get out. And here comes death. Oh no, I'm still alive. Sweet. Here's a big boom. Where's a medic? There are no medics here, son. No! Oh! Need to patch myself up. Whee! Die! I like how miniguns are not accurate at all in this game. No, the technical issue was my face. <laughs> I face smashed my keyboard. And somehow that, that for some reason, hitting a uh, space bar and like one of the key. God dang, man. Can I blow this up with this? Look how inaccurate this shot is. Just even at this range. Look how inaccurate that is. Jeez. There we go. Wait, wait. Anti-tank? Anti Hello. 
I like this. All right, how about this? Let's do, uh, let's do this. For Woulda, give me one second. I'm sorry, Woulda, that's entirely my fault. Oh yeah, is it up? Okay, cool. I was I was gonna literally go on my phone, grab the stream, and then like uh, paste paste the uh, paste the settings in or paste the uh, link into the uh, the, the uh, paste the link into the actual stream. Kind of weird, but hey, it works. Whoa, that can't be good. There you go. Oh, I found one. <gasps> and an AA cannon. Oh god. Ah, uh, I'm gonna die again. No. So now I feel bad. My own, my own incompetence got in the way of me making fun of Fokker. Fokker, you did it again. I blame you, Fokker. Stop it! All right, now let's see. Where, where? I don't even know where I was. What are you waiting for? So oddly enough, on YouTube, I get a bunch of recommended videos showing capybaras and little dogs being used to hunt rats. Now it's a mystery. That's right. It's not a myth stream without at least one technical problem that I cause. <laughs> it's, it's it's not it's not a real stream unless I've broken something. <laughs> and you know what the best part about it is? Like technically, 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 all I've done is make the stream start on time instead of early. <laughs> Look, look, it's not a real... Would you, would, would you feel the same? Would you feel the same level of care and effort went into a stream unless I did break something? I thought there was something over here, too. Hold on. There's a downed plane. Oh, my God. There's the North Karens. If only Ron was here to say nuclear or nuclear of the year or whatever the hell he says. There's C4. I thought there was a uh, myth channel Yannickin. Now this myth is streaming. Now this is myth streaming. <laughs> oh my god. See, you see, everybody has problems with that with those movies. I do not. I think those movies are absolutely fantastic. There it is. Cha-ching. Cha-ching. Prehistory earrings. Prehistory earrings. So they are earrings before the realms of history. So then how do you know? Locked and loaded. There we go. Alright, I gotta get in my Blackhawk and go hunting again, because I gotta find that thing. Let's see. I have to go find that singular person. Me watching this start a new game on difficult. I've got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> well, sir, you are not far off the beaten path there. Oh, this is a uh, this is A N. Yeah, this is Allied Nations. Yay! Well, can I come in? I want to. I want to steal a helicopter from you. Oh, look! I just want to steal a helicopter. Do you even have any helicopters here? Oh, you know what? I, I completely forgot. There's a really cool helicopter in this game that, that uh, I completely forgot about. Hey. Uh, it's like the um, the stealth helicopter thing. I thought that was the coolest thing in the world. Alright, let's see what we got. Uh, do we have anything good back here? Don't Negative? Yeah, no, I, it's, the, it's the Korean helicopters. And they should be in here. Traitor? I haven't betrayed anybody. I like how now all the Koreans speak perfect English. Look what we got here. I was upset that Lucas wasn't me uh, man enough to go through with the death of Jar Jar plot twist, and we watched him dethrone Palpatine. Well, that is a bit of a big sell for that. <laughs> Oh, 
Or sorry, not a big sell, a hard sell for that. Um, I, see, here's the thing. I didn't necessarily mind Jar Jar whenever I saw that. I thought that Jar Jar was silly and a bit dumb, but that's about it. I mean... When I saw those stealth helicopters, I was like, oh, hell, no, nah, man, the stealth helicopters are great, but they should be here. Because America, uh, sorry, not America, the AN, the Allied Nations has, um, there's Blackhawks and that's it. Oh, Felix. I just love how whenever the Star Wars fandom sees something they don't like, uh, they, they love to attack the actor. See, that, ne I never understood that. I, I genuinely don't. Like, um, the actor that did Jar Jar Binks, I, 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 look, you can say I hated the character, but he did a fantastic job making me believe that character existed. Even as a kid, when I was like, when people told me they hated it so much, I didn't understand it because I was like, well, he did a really good job. And people were like, oh, that guy's, you know, that guy's basically a bad person. <laughs> well, the thing about stealth helicopters in this game is that they're not very stealthy. They tend to just pretend to be stealthy. No, I agree, but like, don't go after the actor. The same guy that was like, oh, you know, the kid that played Anakin. Um, like, people went after him, and I was like, why? He didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, we're way. Like, you know, people were like, you know, I guess making fun of him or whatnot. I didn't know about this until years later. I, I just assumed that he did a pretty good job, because I was really, really little when I actually saw the movies. Um, and so I, I, I didn't understand why people were so mad at the actors for... You know, just doing their jobs. You know, I, as much as I thought the lines were cheesy from... Uh, like, as much as I thought the lines were cheesy for young Anakin, I didn't think they were bad because they fit. Yes, you did, Beth. The actor ruined this, ruined the Star Wars. That is my childhood they're ruining. No, Disney is ruining your childhood right now. If you thought George Lucas was uh, violating it before, I have some really bad news for you. <laughs> Uh, let's see, where's that? Where's that dirt road? Lucas should have never hired him. The kid is bad at actor and everything he's been. I, I really don't know. I, I I genuinely don't know. The the alias are attacking you. <laughs> is there anything over here? Oh, there it is. There's my there's my <gasps> look 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 and fate brought me here again. It's one of ours. Nukes. Look what we got here. A mobile WMD lab. I don't even know what that is. I've got something for you to do. Brought to you by getting shot down. No. We don't get shot down here. Macaulay Culkin. See, Macaulay Culkin though did a good job. He was he, his family has been actors for a long time. As a matter of fact, I, I think his I think the uh, the 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 home that he lived in for a long time was the actual home they filmed Home Alone One in, if I'm not mistaken. All right. So first thing we're gonna do, I'm gonna circle back around. This thing flies like a goddamn brick. Oh, but down, 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 down. Oh, oh, come on, I went down. I went down, leave me alone. Oh, crap. It's that, uh, it's that, that A gun. Run! Come here, you. Come here, you. Come here, you. Come here, you. Yeah! Dead man. Dead man dead. I'm gonna run you over. I'm gonna run you. Oh, you're dead. Sorry. You better treat the, the Russian mob with respect like they deserve. What is this, Halo? Oh, uh, actually... 
Uh, this is pre-Halo, I think, right? I want to be careful what I'm shooting at. I do, see, I do like this, though. Like, See, this is the thing. Environmental storytelling I've always really enjoyed. And this is a great piece of environmental storytelling, even though it looks like garbage because it's old. Um, the idea that there's a train here, there's a train wreck, there's a guy, obviously. So why is this guy here? Why is this, this important character here? Oh, it's because he was on the train and he survived the train crash. Is this mission for the South Korea? This is not a mission. This is just... What the hell? Where's this guy? Oh, he's up there. God dang it. Alright, so I need to get back in the Blackhawk. Hopefully it's still there. Please don't tell me you despawned. Please don't tell me you despawned. No, game! This is why you need to remaster so that you can have more memory. No! It's one of ours. I've made a terrible mistake, chat. I've made a terrible mistake. But yeah, th this is a demission. I'm just doing the, the deck of cards. Yeah! This game was awesome on the OG Xbox. See, Fokker? Everybody knows this game but you because you're bad man. You just don't know what it is to have actual fun sometimes. Sometimes. Playground of... Just, and after we're doing one, we're doing two. This is Mercenaries, Playground of Destruction. Oh yeah, no, I love that. Dude, there were so many different me mechanics that I loved in this game. Bye-bye. Felix, what are you doing? Well, you, 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 you go ahead. You tear up all those papers, because that's bills and stuff that's already on autopay. Hello, what's this? Oh, it's just an ammo box. But yeah, no, I, I like... I, back to what I was saying. I like, so I like environmental storytelling. Fallout 3 did a pretty good job of environmental storytelling, but I like this. It's, you know, hey, a train broke... Or, sorry, this, was, this train was crossing, it was blown up, and here's all the pieces, and now there's stuff you can salvage from it, or there's characters down here that you need to look for, that kind of stuff. I like that. All right. Good night, Wooda. Thanks for stopping by. See you later. And good luck with your new job. But I love environmental storytelling like that, and and uh, uh, no, there there's multiple endings. I think well, technically you have multiple endings. Um, they're all kind of the same, but they the way it happens can be different. There we go. All right, so I have to go find this guy over here. Here we go. So discover this on YouTube and it's truly eye-opening. I don't know if it is. In Fallout 3? Uh, in Fallout 3, I remember them being like the water purifier. I don't know what that is, but honestly, I probably don't want to know. <laughs> I probably don't want to know. See, the Enclave in Fallout is like one of the few, like, one of the factions that I, I want them to kind of expand upon. But at the same time, I don't. Because if they do, they're going to ruin it. Yeah, I thought that you were just trying to fix the water purifier. Yeah, that's what I thought. I wish Nani or Rishi could join the Enclave. Yeah, no, I think it'd be cool too. Or at least a faction of the Enclave, you know? But, but the Enclave is, I wouldn't even say highly secretive, because that's, that's true, and yet it's not really prevalent. Okay, um, I am in a box canyon. That makes this much more difficult to get out of. Okay, so let's see, do I have, I have nothing. Can I call in for an extraction? Nope. Uh, so, but there's so many different things you could do with, with the Fallout lore. I mean, it just depends upon what you actually want to do. Hey! Physics don't matter! Here we go. I forgot. There are no physics in this game. I can do whatever the hell I want. I'm in a tank.
You ever play Scarface? The World? No, I did not. But a girl, it's a girl I liked a long time ago. She got it and wanted me to play it with her. But I never, I never played it. I was too busy looking at her. <laughs> And then her cousin came over and she liked me a lot, so that was kind of nice too. <laughs> Look what we got here. Anti-tank rocket drop. But I, I know of it, but I never played it. Hello, Sam Sight. I'm probably like, doing no damage to this thing. In New Vegas, who did you normally side with? Oh, so New Vegas, I I, I only played it through all the way once. Um, I pl and when I did, I played as uh, the NCR. But I really wanted to join Caesar's Legion. But I, I already built my character up in a way that was... Because I was trying to roleplay as a good guy. But uh, I, I will play an actual new playthrough of C, uh, of New Vegas. Like, I plan to do that in the near future. I know, but I, as a kid, I was like, I won't be the good guys. That's the NCR. How do you know that? Because because they're the, they're Americans. They're, they're not, they're, they're California. California, not bad. I went the anarchist ending in the first time and then finished all of them. See, that might be the way that I would go now too. But I want to play through a Caesar's Legion campaign. Just... Just plays the Caesar's Legion. I think it'd be a lot of fun. Oh no, they're worse than that. The NCR is is way worse than that. They're corrupt. If see if you just tax people, that's fine. To an extent. But I personally believe the Le Legion would have definitely won the second battle of Hoover Dam without the courier. <laughs> ah. Oh no, I, 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 if, I, if I'm going to choose one, I'm going to choose the Legion. But again, the last time I played it all the way through, I was a kid. So I actually have it. It's on my list of games to play. Yeah, he's the only one because of the Courier. Then they have zero allies, and the Legion already has three. Like, don't get me the wrong. You know, Legion's still much better, still. You know, absolutely. Uh, Mr. House was an interesting idea as well, but uh, I just chose. Nope, I wanted to. Blow, I wanted to be. I wanted to be the good guys. That's what I thought, and I re didn't realize that I'm the good guy. <laughs> but yeah, no, New Vegas was a great game. I love New Vegas. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Uh, but then, like, um, when I played, what was it? The um. Uh, who is who is Caesar's right hand man that you you meet? Uh, uh, I can't remember his name. It's a, it's a religious name, but I can't remember what it is. Also, if you're looking at the story, the Legion is the most proactive faction in the war. They do all the. That'll be oh, to the allies. They do all those plans while the NCR, for the most part, is doing nothing. Uh, not Legatus. It's the um, the guy that uh, Joshua Graham. Joshua Graham. Joshua Graham. You said it right as I right as I remembered it, Joshua Graham. He is. I, when I played that section, I only played, I only played that section once, and I want to play it again because I don't remember much about it. But I remember every single time that guy talked, I was like, this, this is what I'm missing, because that's a great vengeance bad guy, right? He's just really cool. I love it. Because everything that he does is like blood and thunder Bible stuff. Which it, and in a Wild West kind of story, which is what Fallout kind of is, it works so well. And as, as a matter of fact, in media in general, I think we need to bring back a little bit more of the, uh, the blood and thunder kind of Bible character. Just because they're, I find them so fun. Yes. There should be vehicles pouring out of here. I've been watching Boardwalk Empire and Van Alden is kind of like that. I've never seen Boardwalk Empire. I, I don't know. 
I there's very very few TV shows I get to watch. Like I, I haven't even the show that I've been watching recently is uh, Stargate uh, SG One. I, I I've I'm still working on finishing it, even though I should have probably already finished it by now. I very seldomly get to watch TV shows. I I think I get like an opportunity once every couple days to watch a TV show. And at that point I'm usually having to do something else. So I usually if I if I end up watching TV, it's usually like in the background while I'm working or at really late at night and I can't sleep. I also kind of like uh, a religious zealotry because many people would probably from form new religions or see the world as sinful and the great war was God's punishment. Um, I, I th that kind of sounds like the um, the Wasteland Two version of events, whereas Fallout was more of like a, a, a standard war. Wasteland Two is a bit more uh, well. There was the regular war, but there was also a nuclear war afterwards. I think for like religious zealots, the Children of the Atom. Or not the children of the animal, whatever they're called. Alright, so that's right, I forgot. There's a whole bunch of AA over here. Demilitarized zone. Doesn't seem so demilitarized to me, sir. Alright, I gotta find that last guy. Fallout 4, Children of the Atom are religious zealots. Yes, they are. They are. Uh, let's see. Nope. Oh, hello, BMP. Please tell me you've got helicopters here now. No. I refuse to move forward until I find all the freaking, you know, Peoples, they gotta be around here somewhere. Uh, you ever played the battlefield game where you could posse your friendly units and zip to them by hitting wires? No, battlefield game? I I don't know anything about that. Uh, I think the last battlefield game I played, like consistently, was four. Come on, where is it? Uh, I'd like to see them be more of a major faction. The the Children of the Atom. See, I'm okay with them not using them. Um, because the, the thing is, that it's kind of overplayed in my opinion. The idea that the people worship the nuclear bomb. Um, there needs to be a, a take on old world religions. Like, you know, a mixture of like Judaism, Islam, and uh, Christianity or something. And that's like the new religion. S something like that. Um... It, it, maybe I, I'm not saying it's not, I'm not saying there's there's no possibility, but it's kind of overplayed. I'd like for something to, you know for a world like Fallout, which is equally ridiculous and gritty. I would like to see it be a little bit more. Um, I would like to see it be a little bit more uh, gritty in that regard. Look what we got here. Attack! What's happening? I... I guess? <laughs> I would just like to see the, uh... I, I would just like to see it be a little bit more grit when it comes to the actual religious side of it. Oh, hello! Jeez! What the heck? Whoa! That can't be good. Run, 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 run! God, where is this guy? Let's see, uh, is there intel on him? Let's see. It's close thing to, well, there's no doubt operate currently from the president of Kim's government. Cho is responsible for ensuring that neither Kim nor his closest advisors ever learned of Song's plan. I recovered the location of Cho at the Nine of Clubs. Cho is the security chief for Dung Huang Bo, but his files don't make any reference to any of the military training. Don't expect much of a fight. You'll find him north of the DMZ. Okay. North of the DMZ. And the DMZ is Allied Nation territory. Your SNS signal's being jammed. 
Ah, that place sucks. Oh my god, there's so much freaking missiles! No! I made it. I made it, chat. I did it. I wasn't scared even for a second. But yeah, so like, um, for Wasteland and Fallout, I, I would like to see a little bit more grit to some of the religious stuff. Um, even though like they try to be ridiculous with it, they I, part of me goes they don't go too far enough. If you tried spinning it, I hear that's a good trick. Yeah. I I have tried spinning in this thing, but as I said, this thing is like a brick. <laughs> it's a, I am flying a giant brick. Battlefield 2 Modern Combat. I... I don't think I played Battlefield 2. Oh, no, 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 god dang it! Oh. Well, they're on my ride, so... Oh, sweet, that one's down. Hey, I just crashed my helicopter, can I take yours? No? Oh, okay, you, you seem busy, I, I guess I'll... Hello, what's this? Oh, it's just a... It's just a Stop it. I don't remember there being a zip line in there, though. You can switch to your AI allies mid-game. Oh, that's pretty cool. So I, one one thing I plan to play in the near future is going to be Call to Arms, which uh, allows it's a strategy game that allows you to take control of the units. I, exactly. Somehow I had an airfield accident. All right, so he's supposed to be north of the DMZ. So okay, so he's at the fifty. Is fifty three or fifty two? We'll go this way. Yeah, so I, uh, Battlefield 2 is a game that, I, 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 when it was out, I didn't have a computer. I, I didn't have a computer until I was much, much older. Let's see. First things first, let's see if that little crate has anything for me. Nope. Get out of it. So, is it SMG, RPG? Don't want SMG? No, I don't want the SMG. I'll take the carbine. Sorry, Carbine. Attack. Battlefield 2 is on the uh, original Xbox? I didn't know that. Locked and loaded. I did not know that. Attack. But I guess that, does, that makes sense considering the fact that like I didn't get consoles until usually they were out of uh, either well into their life cycle or out of their life cycle. Here we go. We're just going right through. We will find the enemy and beat him with my own rifle and then send him on a nice little trip on, on a helicopter. Yeah! Right here he is! Location. Is that just a machine gun? Yeah, it's just a machine gun. Please don't have a tank. Get out of the way. Here we go. Charge. Yeah. I, I can't kill him with that. Charge. Do not do not kill him. Do not kill him. Charge. Thank God. There we go. All right, so I need to move this stuff out of the way and then get my helicopter up. Wee! No, you're not. Roger, this is Expo Two. I am in the air. A zip lines in a battlefield game. I don't know about that. I want to say bad company. I will, again, Payday 2 will get back in the lineup eventually. Um, I got a couple things I want to do before we get back to it. Again, Barrow Trauma is one of them. There's a few more games here that I want to play. Don't you dare take my helica- Oh, you son of a biscuit. Felix. Yes. Now, chat. Now we are ready to go hunt down the ace. Good job. 
Only now have our skills increased enough to where we can afford to go hunt down an ace. If only I still had my god dang helicopter! I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Not mad. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Here we go. Actually, you know what? There is a new game that I, I, I just recently discovered called the Men of War series. I know they're old as sin, but uh, I've, I've I've just recently discovered them. That's going to be on my list in the next, uh, probably, no, not the next playthrough, but they're going to be hopefully soon. Actually, hold on. Nah, I'll be all right. Here we go. It's the mercenary. How'd you know? Would you like to know more? Oh my god, so actually, this is another good question. Do y'all want to see the new uh, Starship Troopers game? <laughs> I haven't really uh, thought about it, but all of a sudden I was like, would you like to know more popped into my head. Would that be something that y'all would be interested in watching, the new Starship Troopers game? Would you like to know more? Or is, is Starship Troopers even then too niche? It does. But I don't think it's going to get much more than what it's got. First ace contract. Come on in and I'll give you the details. Division 39 was basically a state-sponsored mafia before President Kim found out about it. Wangbo's probably spent a lot of cash getting ready to defend himself. Yeah, and we're about to spend a lot of cash taking him out. Oh. Hey, Merc. Glad you could make it. We're ready to clear you for your first ace contract. Try to keep the casualties down, if you can. Who well. else? to the intel you gathered, we now know the ace of clubs, Dung Wang Bo, head of Division 30. Dung Wang! ...in the vicinity of Song Tower. Wang Bo's using GPS jammers to blind our satellites. This may mean Song's nearby, too. If you can destroy the jammers, we'll locate Wang Bo, and you can bag it. Maybe get Song, too. Then we can all go home, huh? Felix, say hi. Felix. Felix. Say hi, Felix. I thought President Kim was a good guy. Why the hell would he let someone like Wang Bo work for him? Your first ace contract. Oh, that's right. These are special missions. Wow. I can tell you've been practicing your pep speeches. The nuke ch Wait, what? The nuke China ending? Whoa, whoa, wait. Time out, time out. What are we talking about here? That sounds like a fun ending. Lost to the bamboo. Woo! What? 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 Blow up! Blow up! There we go. I don't know the ending where you go Look through the Carlos plane and the Chinese is, not, is not, that kind of thing. No, no, no. So uh, there's only one ending to the game. Uh, it, you can get there through different means, but there's only one ending to the game. Uh, in this case, I am gonna need the RPG more than I'm gonna need the anti-tank gun. I'm gonna, Felix. Come here, Felix. Come here, Felix. I mean, I, I, if there is a way to nuke China in this game, I totally, I'm totally on board with it. But no, as far as I know, there's no way to nuke China. It sounds funny, though. Aw, oh, so that, that poor family. But then again, it's North Korea. The infrastructure is terrible. It's just like Detroit. Your SNS <laughs> signal's being jammed. <laughs> Oh crap. Can I steal you? Hey, don't you run away from me. Don't you run away from me. I want that because it's, it's going to be somewhat protected. <laughs> they just hop out. Grenade!
Oh, I can't get to the. Oh, god dang it. The gun is indiv is independent of the actual armored car. Your SNS signal's being jammed. That's dumb. Oh, rockets. Get him. Look at all this Cold War air attack. It's like I'm in Ukraine. Added NVG, flashbangs, tear gas, grapples, zip lines, mechanics, and addition to new weapons and vehicles. That sounds pretty cool. Ow. Here we go. Ow. Whee! I don't even know what vehicle this is. I, I, I don't recognize it at all. It's just an armored car. I have no idea what vehicle I'm driving at this. I don't know. I don't know what this is. Alright, let's see what we got next. I mean, it is, but I don't know what kind of APC it is. Like, I, it's not a BMP, I can tell you that much. Gotta be quiet, stealthy. See, gotta be, gotta be stealthy out here. Who knows who could be watching? Like this guy right here! He spotted me! Don't turn the alarm on, damn it! See, now they're all mad at me. All the forest Koreans are coming after me. That's not okay. God dang. Just drive casually. What do you mean drive casually? <laughs> Let's see here. Alright, so we're going to do this the fun way. We're gonna to try to do something that I haven't done in a while. That's two jammers down. Looks pretty easy so far. Oh, wrong thing. Oh, no, 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 no. I mean this game makes zero sense. Whoa, no, 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 not that. Break this, break this, I don't, I don't want this anymore. God dang it. Get me out of this. I don't want to be here anymore. No! There we go. This game makes perfect sense. Take out the jammers. But this game this game was designed though to be a so this game was made at a point in time whenever like we were starting to get sandboxy games, but it was one of the only ones that did it, right? So there's lots of little things in here that don't make sense, but that's okay cuz the game was designed to be just, hey, let's make a game where we can just blow stuff up and destroy cities. That was the whole point of this game. All right, now where is it? Ah! But games that make sense are always more fun. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. No! Oh! I took down the building, but I didn't take out the freaking jammer? What is this? It's Korean engineering, that's what it is. Oh! Snap! That hurt. Okay, I may fail this mission right now. Run, 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 run. Okay, just blow this up. That's it. You've the going. Oh, that hurts so bad. <laughs> oh no! No video game, no! Yes, we're gonna try again. God dang. 
And now I get to start from the beginning. Wow, I can tell you've been practicing your pep speeches. Ah, uh, see, you know what would be great today? It would be great is if they made a Mercenaries 3 set in Ukraine and just, and honestly, poked fun at every side. Just made fun of everybody. Like, basically talk about how corrupt the Ukrainians are, talk about how awful the Russians are, and instead of it, the, and the Russian mob is involved, and like, all, everybody that's involved is an awful person. I'd play that game. Hell, I, I, I would pay full price for that game. Alright, so now I got Chef C4 on this guy. Here we go. Let's see how far we can push him. Here we go. Boom! Oh, I guess we didn't push him at all. We just ran him over. Alright, so let's just go take out the first one, which is right over here. You see Joe Biden in the corner falling off his bike and sniffing child there and asking them to destroy his life. See, that's the thing. You could do that kind of crap because in, in uh, Mercenaries One, it's a very serious, uh, it's a very serious story, right? It's a bit ridiculous for the gameplay, but the story-wise, it's actually relatively serious. For Mercenaries Two, it's completely and utterly ridiculous. They they go out of their way to make the game as ridiculous as possible. I need to, up. Oh, before I go any further, I need to actually put the C4 on this guy. Is he tired of your wanting to help out by giving them a coupon of Domino's instead? <laughs> Pretty much, yes. Uh, because like in, in, in the second one, the Jamaican pirates are, they replaced the Russian mafia. And the main bad guys are the Venezuelans. The only good guy in the actual like story for the, for the second game is arguably the Venezuelan president, but everybody else is either like, oh, you know, they're going to war because they want the resources of Venezuela, not because they want to help Venezuela. Whereas in this one, like the allied nations go to war because they want to help. God dang it. The tree Koreans are coming to get me. Why are you getting in here? That's not going to help you. That's two jammers down. Looks pretty yeah. Easy, huh? Oh, yeah, it's just so easy. Yeah, absolutely. No, I've never died here. Nope, never. Free money. Don't leave money on the table. There we go. It's the entirety of your... Yeah, so... So yeah, like, you can make fun of a lot of that stuff. I think mean, it'd be great because you could you could have that like just you could still have the same time period or roughly the same time period. Um, although this isn't Cold War, this is like '90s, 2000s. But you could have a lot of fun doing that. But they, I don't think anybody would be brave enough to do it. But like you, you can have the good guys do all the stupid crap that Zelensky's doing. You can have the bad guys be the evil Russians, and like you just curb stomp them every step along the way, and you could you could attack both sides. Like, I think it'd be a good idea. Ah! Ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow. Okay, I guess we're I guess we're dying again today, guys. Oh, God. Yep, 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 yep. So, I learned a lesson. And that lesson is, um... Don't charge, uh, machine gun... Uh, grenade launchers. It's bad. It's bad for your health. Wow, I can tell you've been practicing your pep speeches. Took three rockets. Yeah, I know, right? Look. I'm just gonna say that uh, black black Americans they're just built different. <laughs> I'm just saying, black black men just uh, they don't get hurt like that. Okay. <laughs> it was uh, it was his uh, Americans just they're just immune to bullets and explosives. What can I say? Die. Here we go. 
There we go. He was a football player back in high school. This is why he's able to take the rocket to the chest. That's right. He used to be an adventurer, and not only did he take an arrow to the knee, it never stopped him. I'm gonna Allahu Akbar this thing. I, 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 they, we, we need more games that are irreverent to everybody. We need that nowadays. Everybody needs to be made fun of. Everybody. Bye-bye, <laughs> building. Bye-bye. Alright, let's go find another little thing bob that gets me around from A to B. Oh, this one. Give. 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 So, more South Park and Stick of Truth. Uh, dude, I haven't played that game in so long. Uh, maybe, yeah. I don't remember them making fun of everybody. I think it was just kind of a funny idea. It was like the idea that these kids were just making nothing or something out of nothing. I know the, uh, the, the, the superhero one, which I, I never finished the superhero one. That one was funny. I liked that one. Uh, but that one was making fun of Marvel, but that's just, that's just the whole shtick. No, no, god dang it, I need to get it closer. I need to get my mobile bomb carrier right there, there we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, and... Boom! It looks pretty easy so far. Third time's the charm. And let's, let's load these guys up. There we go. What? There we go. Better. There was one thing in South Park, the stick of truth, that, like, oh my god, it made me, like, it genuinely made me cringe. Like, I was whinging in pain. Was the abortion section for, like, is it Randy or whoever? Like, they had to, like, you mess up and you suck his ball out and, like, just shred it. I was like, oh! <laughs> I was like, oh my god. I was, I couldn't handle that. I was like, <laughs> I felt my legs grow weak at that. I was just like, no, no. Even the horrible graphics of South Park, it just the idea of having your ball like just ripped out of your out of your ball sack, just and then put through a meat shredder, just like oh my god, why, why game, why? And the answer is simple: it's because they wanted the exact reaction that I gave them. All right, you want to go? You want to go? You want to go? There you go. You're dead. Now you can't hurt me no more. Deep, deep, deep. Your SMS deep. signal's being jammed. Oh, oh, look at that. And perfect. This thing's about to. Oops. Oh, get, 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 get out, get out, get out, get out. Run! Crap! I don't have anything to work with. Grenades, it is! Alright, I'll pick up your RPGs. I'll work with that. I'll work with this. Fire! Another happy landing. <laughs> We're just gonna meme Star Wars. Unlimited! Oh, is that a tank? Oh my god, give me the tank! Give me the tank! Give me the tank! Oh, gonna be messy in there. I like how I haven't used any of the actual support features they've given me. See, one of the things they did do in the second game was they actually did uh, give your tanks secondary fire. So that way you weren't just, you know, stuck using the main battle cannon. Boom! 
What kind of engineering is that? Can't even take two cannon rounds from a Cold War era tank. I don't know what is this, like a T-60 or T-55? No, not T-55. It's like T-62? I don't know. I don't know. Alright, so what's this over here? Uh, there is a secondary location right here. Disguised as North Korean. Alright, do I kill all of them? Or what do I do here? There we go. Oh, do I get reinforcements? Excellent. That was a nice easy bonus, wasn't it? Okay, just a bonus. Bam! Oh, missed. Whoa, that can't be good. Lead the target, Myth! Oh, missed him again. Ow, stop it! I'm trying to blow the tank. There you go. Oh, another one! Another one! Here we go! Yes! Oh, come on, let me run him over. All right, there should be some helicopters. There we go. Hello, helicopters. Oh, wait, what's this? What was that giant looming shadow of death that just walked over me? <gasps> no! It's a gunship! Oh, God, I'm stuck. Well, at least the machine gun fire is not going to do much to me. That's always nice. Oh, thank you. Well, that hurts. Run, 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 run. Okay, I need... Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. No! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! There we go. Come on. Just blow it up, 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 blow it up. Okay, that's fine. As long as the bomb lands, I don't care. Now you, you, you gotta die. Oh, come on. Come on. Perfect. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. Ah, oh, come on, come on. Yes, 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 yes. No! I know. Oh, God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I don't even know where I'm getting shot from now. There he is. God dang it. No, 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 I need health. I need health so bad. Oh my god. Just get me someplace where I can I can I can not be seen. Now this is Mr. Oh my god. Alright, can I can I can I get in the vehicle now and, and not be dead? Alright, I need to get supplies. Uh, Chinese supply drop, sniper rifle supply drop, cover supply drop. That I prefer? Uh, I I like GTA, but I like mercenaries a lot too. Uh, let's see, six thousand. Pretty much. Okay, I'm there shooting at me. I don't care. Just drop, just drop off what I need. I need the help. Yeah, boy. Back to 100 health. Look at that. Do I get any uh, RPG ammo? And I get some RPG ammo. I should probably switch back to the carbine, too, but oh well. It's, it's, just, it's just more accurate. What can I say? Let's go. Let's fucking go. Now, if I can find 
that freaking attack helicopter. There you are. All right. You're just going to chill out there. So that, 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 that right there is one of my favorite helicopters in the game because of those freaking rocket pods they have underneath. You just can dump rockets on everything that gets near you. It's a lot of fun. All right, but I do kind of need to be careful because, as you can see, they have lots of bad people running around over here. I, I need to blow that thing up first. I, I gotta get rid of that thing. Uh, I already blew up the SAM site. Uh, do they, I wonder if they have another one. Do they have another one of those things laying around over here? Maybe they've got like a random SAM site deployed somewhere over here. Let's look around real quick. Let's look around for that little SAM site. See if they got a little uh, a SAM launcher somewhere. Oh look, a re-education camp with a helicopter! Perfect! That is the second best thing I could possibly ask for. And look, they have supplies. Here we go! Die! No. There's absolutely zero... 0% zero chance that you're going to beat me in this. I should be tearing you apart. Oh my god. I'm going to burn all my ammo and nothing's going to happen, is it? Oh, come on. Oh, got him! With a freaking anti-tank weapon. Yes! Yes! That is what I'm talking about. That is what I want to see. Now, where's that other little helicopter? It's just, it's just so easy to blow stuff up with helicopters. It's just so easy to blow stuff up with helicopters. I see why the United States uses them so much. They love them. They're great. I <laughs> should have ran with the helicopter. Never mind. Alright. You, sir. Look at this fat man carrying around that giant RPK. Or whatever it is. PPK, RPK, I don't even know. There we go. I see your smoke. I'm at the LZ. I have I can't walk over a fence. So this this man is so fat I cannot walk over a fence. Oh my god. Please don't shoot me. Perfect. You're North Koreans. You obviously don't care what's happening here. You're a communist. You obviously don't care if, if one of your dear leaders is being attacked and taken by the Americans. Why should you care? They've done nothing for you. I don't know. He seemed fine to me. And that's how we saved America. How much money do I get? Give me money, give me money, give me money! 150 grand! Contract fee, 150 grand! Back then when 150 grand was a lot of money! And though General Song remains at large, the dramatic capture tonight of Ace of Clubs Dung Hwang Bo by AN troops must be considered a huge victory for the Allies. In a statement released earlier this evening, the President congratulated the Commando Unit Task Force 724 for the success of their daring raid on Hwangbo's base of operations here at Song Tower. South Korean troops, meanwhile, secured a number of military sites in the area, including the airfield at Incheon. GSRN oh, no, I take it. military analysts have no explanation for how the relatively small South Korean forces in the area were able to secure such an important location. Reporting live from the smoldering ruins of the once imposing Song Tower, this is Adriana Livingston for GSRN. Yes! The Bunker Buster Bomb! 
Perfect. Division 39's been taken care of. Be on the lookout for the Ace of Diamonds. That's General Chang and his men. Chang's responsible for Sung's biological and chemical weapons programs. Mmm. Biological chemical wep- Mm-hmm. Too bad I can't get a hold of those. Oh, that's what we should have next. They should have definitely added that into the, the Mercenaries game. Like having animations and different things that you could use with uh, biological weapons. Ah, oh, that'd be so cool. All right, so we probably don't have much time left. I'm probably gonna just do a. Let's see what I want to do real quick. I want to look for some things. I want to see if I can get get some vehicles and turn them back into the. Uh... And, and you know, what? let's do that. Let's do let's let's turn some vehicles back into the Russians. Let's do what Ron would do and make the make the uh, Chinese or make the Russians happy. We're gonna go steal a Chinese tank. And then we'll call it quits. Oh yeah, no, but yeah, but yeah for 150 grand, I mean, I'm not gonna really complain if I got 150 grand. I'm just saying that back then, 150 grand is not even what it was, you know, a few years ago. I always find it funny that's like, um, I'll watch, like, so I watched Home Alone last year, and you know, it was funny as the kid was like buying a toothbrush and like groceries for one person for the week and it came out to be like $20 and now granted he's a kid he's buying lots of junk food but he's still buying like food for the week and it's like 19 like 50 something and I was like dude like e even before everything went to hell and back or not even back yet everything before even before everything went to hell $19 ain't gonna get you very far <laughs> Here we go. Let's see. And yeah, right up here. Ah, uh, yeah. Here we go. Let's see if we can. Let's see if we can uh, liberate some tanks from the, uh, the our our lovely allies, the Chinese. We're gonna liberate them for the sake of the cause, chat. Let's see, I gotta get my little vehicle here. A BJ2020 Scout. BJ2020 sounds like a rock concert for, like, tweens. <laughs> no, I don't. Tell me. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here are my tanks. Give me tanks. A Type 80 tank. And I'm gonna turn it into the Russians. There we go. Bye bye. Here we go. You're both wrong. Wendy's has Frosties. <laughs> ah. Oh my god, some of the freaking like the, the curbs here are just awful. See, the last time I ate at Wendy's, I got so sick, I almost, like, I, not almost, I did puke up all over the floor and the walls. Like, I got really sick. Now I feel like the tank is going slower than it was before. I know, this is the exciting part where we now we just watch stuff. We just watch this stuff. It's ice cream in a cup. Well, wh what do you normally serve ice cream in? Like, I'm genuinely curious now, like, what, where, where does ice cream normally get served in? BAM! <laughs> the Chinese witnessed a hostile act, and that means they don't trust me anymore, even though I blew up a North Korean jeep thingy. See, I, I can tell right now that Fokker's all mad. Because he's like, well, they don't tell you, are you using AP rounds? Are you using heat? Are you using AT? Like, what are we doing here? <laughs> I 
I don't know, sorry, I need to give him the, I need to give him a little bit of a bit of What are we doing here? I don't understand. Why, why is the tank not telling me what kind of ammunition is loaded in the gun? <laughs> I'm not upset. I'm just pitting the full play of the game. <laughs> uh, it sounds to me like Fokker's just never had a good milkshake. That's what it sounds like to me. Free money, free money, free money, free money, free money. Bam! No! I'm going to do uh, an ice cream product. I'll get a bl See, blizzards can be good, but it depends, right? It still depends. Oh, gotta shoot that down. Gotta blow that up. Something about dictators and having statues. And let's... Is that an enemy vehicle? Yes. Blizzards are amazing. That's why I never eat them. I... I think the last blizzard I ate was like the double fudge brownie blizzard. That was like... It was so chocolatey. That by the time I was done, my like my mouth was just so... It, was, it, it felt like it was blistered and just dry. Gotcha. Who says that a standard tank can't be an AA defense? Cookie Dough Blizzard. Um... I, I, yeah, I do like that one too, but like, I, that's not the one that I had. It was like, it was a special they ran for a while. Oh, you're talking about somebody else, never mind. McDonald's also makes pretty good uh, milkshakes. Dairy Queen, steak and shake. Dairy Queen's pretty good too. $24,000. All right, I think that was a good place to stop. So we, we've finally captured an ace. I've managed to screw up my own stream. <laughs> I think we've uh, I think we've made a good good little progress there. At this rate, it'll be like what another couple of weeks, and then we'll be done, ideally. Oh yeah, no, I'm, this is the mafia. I'm selling a tank on the, to the Russian mob. I don't think I'm gonna get a fair deal, but at the same time, it didn't cost me anything. So you know, there's that. So, I just want to say thank you everybody for coming out and watching this evening. I hope to see you all again soon. If you all have not and you do, uh, do you enjoy the chat, please give us a follow. We also have Discord links in the, in the, uh, the channel below. So, <laughs> maybe. I don't know if the mob wants to touch a tank. So, I will hope to see you all again on Wednesday. Have a good night.